Happy International Women's Day. Today we launch a series in which we introduce female members of staff of the CARICOM Secretariat who are working tirelessly, blazing trails, shattering glass ceilings and creating history in the name of regional integration. We'll feature economists and educators, lawyers and doctors, statisticians and accountants, experts in communication and technology, specialists in culture, gender, the environment, and aviation, administrative professionals, career women, community leaders, phenomenal women. We see them, we salute them. Here are excerpts of our conversations with them. Our first guest is a remarkable example of female leadership. She's been shattering ceilings for years, creating history in the region in August 2021 by becoming the first female Secretary General of CARICOM. Yes, I've been um, fortunate enough to have done a few firsts, um, and I recognize that as as um, as achievements of of of, of a personal nature, I suppose, but it's always about the service. It's always about doing the work to the, to the best of my ability. No? So um, I am pleased at this stage to be asked to, to come back to the secretariat um, and to do service at the level of the community. Regardless of gender, it, it's, it, for me, it, the accomplishments stand for themselves. But I think um, the fact that I did those things as a woman makes a difference. Um, but one of the things that we have to be careful of and, and one of the things that I've tried to be careful of throughout is that the exception doesn't become the rule um, because the fact is that we are still underrepresented as women um, in leadership, in decision making across the Caribbean and, and across the world. And so the fact that I have been able to do certain things, to achieve certain positions, do certain kinds of work does not mean that the situation has changed for the majority of women. And so the fight is still there to ensure that as many women as possible can um, have the opportunities to achieve, can have the opportunities to rise up because that's, that's at the end of the day, that is what we would like to see. Stay tuned to our social media platforms where we'll bring you the full interviews.